DJ Sharp MC. Live. Back on the track. All right. It's time for a 2.10 update. So you go to preferences, you go to update, go to USB, go to upgrade, go to do it. All right, so we'll see what uh, all the hype's about. Everybody's released their 2.1.1 videos, and I didn't get an early copy, so we're going to do the USB update live together and uh, see what's in this mug. Usually it doesn't take that long. Hopefully we won't have any surprises because I hate surprises. And I haven't had too many bugs with the updates. For the most part, it's been pretty smooth. I think 2.8 and 2.9 had a few hiccups when you loaded stuff weird. But uh, I think I went to the website, clicked on the NPC, downloaded the 2.11. It was about 203 megabytes. Put it on my USB stick. Put my USB stick in my NPC one. And uh, yeah. The rest is uh, going on right now. So it looks like it's taking a minute, which uh, sometimes it takes a minute. So I don't know if that's cool, but I usually go through it so that everybody who does the update, they get a live real time kind of scenario of what it's like. And I've seen a lot of features. All right, let's see if this thing reboots. Goes there. Hopefully it's gonna work. And we don't have no audio issues and we don't have no other surprises. Let's see what we got. New plugin instruments are available. You must first download and install their content files. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, okay. I'll have to go see what that's about. Uh... I don't see anything new in the UI, but I thought I was supposed to see something new. So first let's go to, oh, that's changed. How to save files isn't there anymore. Okay, so what do we got here? New project, save, project, preferences. Uh, okay. And I think the main thing was like the browser stuff. Grid view, track view. X, Y, so I guess those are my favorites. Uh, controller mode, and it looks like the memory is displaying here. It used to display in that other mode. All right, so I see a couple new things. I think the main thing was the browser though, so where's the, where's the browser? Browse? I thought the browser was, or was it plugins? Plugins. Sounds. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Height. Okay. All right, so that looks new. Okay. All right, so there's definitely some new stuff there. Sound settings, all right, all right. What else we got? Low presets, baseline, Mellotron, electric, table synth, drum synth. Huh, okay. All right, so I think the other thing was in the effects, right? So let's, uh, let's bring in a sound. See, they still didn't fix that. We'll load a kit real quick. And then it was effects. So program edit. Well, program edit. Oh, I'm on an instrument. I need to go to a sample. So sample, program edit, effects. Okay, doesn't look like anything's changed on that menu. Hey, didn't I just load an effect? Global, what's that? I think they changed the naming on that. Samples. 
envelopes looks the same lfo modulation all right so i'm uh i'm gonna probably have to spend some time with it because uh i don't really see nothing changed in that ui uh for the plugins let's go here let's go here and i guess i'm gonna have to go back and download the plugins because i don't see them so I'll go and maybe do a video on that. Sounds, which we already looked at. Favorites, which I got none. Pad program. Oh yeah, you can hit pad program at any time. Yeah, let's see if that works. So before it was, you hit sample and you load a sound. So let's, uh, let's go to a kit. We'll load that sound. And then supposedly you can pad perform it by going to here. And then you could hit like pad perform, right? Pad mute, track mute, song, list, control. There was a way to do, there was a way to do pad perform on any sound. Uh, edit samples, not there. Key group, not there. Plugin, not there. So I thought there was a way to do, take any sound and do a pad perform with it. Can we do it by hitting shift notes? No, that, where did that take me? Huh, that's interesting. When I hit pad perform, oops, not that, shift pad perform, takes me here, and I thought you could do pad perform on any sound. I don't hear anything on that one. Okay, so that's ditto. All right, well, uh, looks like this video is going to be cut short because uh, I still got to load some sounds. And I still got to load how to do the pad perform. Assign samples is the same. Warp is the same. Uh, hmm. All right, well, I guess that's it for this video. See you next time. DJ Sharp MC. Peace.